Hi guys! So this is my very first vlog and I'm super excited about it. Um, I wanted to discuss internships and why I think they're so important. I'm actually doing an internship right now out of Massachusetts um, for a fashion styling company. Um, and right now this is like a month in. Um, it's unpaid and I am learning so much. It's been so crazy. Um, but I kind of wanted to discuss this because this is my third or fourth internship in my whole entire life um and I've just taken so much away from each and every one of them so I wanted to give you reasons why I think they're so important and why you should do them also how you can get involved in them um so first and foremost obviously it's the experience um you know you're trying to get into a new field right out of college. Um, usually they make you do an internship for school. Um, this is your way of test driving that industry to see if you like it, to see if you're a good fit. Um, it allows you to test out the environment, um, and see what kind of work you're doing on a daily basis, um, the type of people you'll be working with, and just understanding the industry in a more a clear and concise way. So um, this experience allows you to literally go in and work behind someone who's been in the industry for a while and see like what you're going to be doing if that's what you're going to be doing for the rest of your life. And that's how you decide if that's what you want to do. Um, for me, this um, experience that I'm actually doing um, I wanted to try something new. I've actually done an internship within the fashion realm before, um, back in Miami. And I kind of was interested in it back then, but I never had the chance to get into styling. So um, it was kind of something eventually I wanted to do. And I know I'm, you know, it's kind of late. I'm, I graduated in 2014 and, you know, I trying to still figure out what I'm doing with my life. Obviously, I have Blonde Boss, um, but trying to add on to that and make it come full circle. So I feel that this was, for me, like learning the additional skills that I can add to Blonde Boss Media um, by helping, you know, business people and CEOs with dressing. Um, so if they have an event or a huge meeting coming up, I want to be their go-to person to help them dress and make them look professional, match their brand identity, um, and pretty much just help them feel confident. confident. Um, so for me, this experience is like allowed me to obtain so much information that can apply to that, um, that I can eventually use on my own when I finish and complete this internship. Um, so that's like the biggest thing, obviously, gaining that experience that you could have on your resume to say that you've been in that industry, that you've been in that environment. Um, but the second most important thing, um, you're able to learn how to really work for free. Um, yeah, I know that sounds horrible to most people, um, who wants to work for free, who has time for that, right? But, uh, for me, like, I am actually working for free right now. I, like I said, I go in twice a week and, um, I have to, you know, just kind of swallow my pride. And even though I've been working for a couple of years, I have to realize that literally when you come into a new industry, you have to work from the bottom up. So right now I'm at the bottom and I have to learn how to build myself to get to that paid position. Um, so for me, it's kind of humbling and, you know, I appreciate the work more because I see how much goes into styling. Um, I know some people don't think it's a big deal or that it's a hard job. It's probably more fabulous than hard, but it actually takes a lot of work manual work um that I've learned over time actually <laughs> like I realize it's very tiring um so for me it's like I'm appreciating it more even though I'm not getting paid because I know how much these women have worked to get to where they are and um I I appreciate everything that they do and everything that they've taught me even when they're running around like crazy 
they're always trying to help me like learn and understand what they're doing and why they're doing it. Um, so for me, people don't understand that you have to work for free and you know experience it firsthand why that is because if you just think you're going to get paid automatically you're very sadly mistaken um and then lastly but not least um you definitely take away some life lessons so you know obviously besides learning about the industry and the environment you're going to learn about you know time management um you're going to be learning about organization skills you're going to be learning about independence. Um, you know, you're going to learn about just being more detail oriented. Like there's so many things you could take away from it that can apply to so many different industries. Um, so for me, like for the most part, I would say I'm pretty good with time management. Um, but I am always trying to improve on my, you know, attention to detail. Um, I'm very like fast paced all the time and I'm always like doing a million things at once and for me I'm trying to learn how to focus in on one thing and do it literally to the extent where it's absolutely perfect. Um, with internships it actually helps you because you're doing little tasks that you know they can't do because they don't have time um, but you have to do it to the T or else you're in trouble obviously. Um, so for me, it's like I'm learning that right now is making sure I take that couple extra minutes just to perfect it and make sure I double check it, make sure everything's right, give a couple options, you know, go the extra mile just to show like I'm thorough. Um, and that's been so major for me. So for me, I think that my own experiences, um, this has shaped me already and I've only been there for a month. Um, and I think that it's so important and so, like, it's just literally life. Like, <laughs> internships are life. Um, you need to try them out if you, even if you're not, like, in college or anything, or if, even if you're 30 years old or older, like, who cares? Like, if you want to try something new, literally research the people that are top in your industry that you want to go into. Ask them to shadow them for a day. Um, or take an internship, just try it out, see how you like it, like build some contacts, like that's all you have to do and then you can just get right into it whenever you're ready and whatever you think that you've developed enough skills for that industry. Um, and that's like what I've been doing is just trying to connect with anyone and everyone in that fashion styling business because you really never know what could happen and that's the thing about internships. You work hard, you do everything that you're supposed to do, you really never know. You could end up getting that position that you want. So my advice to you guys is try something new. Don't be scared no matter what. Like, does it, it's not too late. Trust me, I'm 25. Like, I mean, it's like past my time of internships, but I'm doing it anyway. So take it from me. Try it out. Um, let me know if you have any questions on it. I'd love to help you out. Um, but yeah, thanks for listening. I'm going to try to do more of these soon. Um, my internship actually ends, um, the end of February, unfortunately. So I'll be trying to do more of these, um, probably in March, but tell me what topics you want to talk about. Um, and hopefully my lighting and everything will be much better. <laughs> um, still getting to, used to this whole thing, so um, don't mind everything right now. I'm at my apartment looking messy. Um, but yeah, thank you so much for listening, and I hope everyone has a great night. All right, have a good night. Bye.